This amazing 3D model of a Red Ranger was made by AI completely for free using this image and even the texture was applied by AI. We also have a 3D model of a dragon that was made and textured by AI using a text prompt and you can also animate or rig your character using the same AI tool for free. Now let us see how you can do the same. The tool we will be using is called Meshi AI and you can access it from the link in the description. This is the interface you will see after opening Meshi AI. To start using it, click here on sign up, enter your email id here and click get code. You will receive a verification code on your email id, copy and paste it here and click continue. You can see we have successfully logged in. Click here on text to 3d and you can now enter your text prompt to generate your 3d model. You can also use images but we will see that later in this video. For now, I have entered a prompt, a dragon with large wings, muscular body with scales, sharp claws and realistic anatomy. We have a few settings here that we can change but you can keep them on their defaults and click generate. You can see 4 different versions of our dragon are being generated here and this tool takes about 2 to 3 minutes to generate these 3D models. Once the models are ready, click on them and you will be able to see all of them on your viewport. You can check which one looks best. I like the pose of the third one so I will click on this magnifying glass to see it in a larger view. I can see that this dragon has two tails so I will highly recommend you to use the image to 3D model feature and avoid text to 3D if possible but for now let's go ahead with it. After clicking on your model once you will get the option to generate texture for your 3D model which is basically the material or color of your 3D model. Yes is selected by default. I will click on confirm. If you don't see this texture option on the right you can click here on texture on the left and after some time you can see that the texture has been applied to our dragon and it looks pretty good. On the top you will find options like solid view, material view, HDRI etc like other 3D modeling tools. We also have wireframe view and you can see the topology of our 3D model. There are a lot of other options available here but you can explore them on your own. Now let's see how you can generate 3D models from images. Here we have the option of image to 3D and batch images to 3D. If you have multiple images of your object from different angles, you should definitely use this option to get a good 3D model. But if you don't have multiple images, then the image to 3D also works well. Click here and select your image. I am using this image of a red ranger. You can change some settings if you want to and click generate. After a few minutes, we have 4 different versions of our red ranger ready. All of them look pretty same but the first one has some more details so I will click on it. I get the option to generate texture, click confirm. I will enlarge it and you can see the model looks really good. Within a few minutes our texture is also ready and it looks even better now. Now it is time to rig and animate our character. Click on rig and we have some basic guidelines here on how our character should be for a good rig. You can read it if you want to but it is pretty basic. You can rig humans or objects with 4 legs. Since we have a human, I will keep it selected and click next. Here, tweak the settings and make sure your character is placed correctly. Click next. Here, we have markers for different joints of the body. Use the reference on the right and adjust your markers. I will turn off the symmetry for this one and adjust these markers. It is possible that your markers are perfectly placed and you don't need to change anything. In that case, just click confirm. I have adjusted my markers. I will now click confirm and after some time you can see our character has been properly rigged and a basic walk cycle has been assigned. We have many different animation presets available here. You can select any and click add. Wait for some time and you can see the new animation has been added to our character. I think this boxing one will look really good so I will click add and after some time you can see that the new animation has been applied to our character and it looks awesome. Now. You can generate 3D models for free using this tool with limited monthly credits but if you want to generate more, you will need to go for the paid plans. Click on upgrade and you can see that we get 100 monthly credits for free. We have the pro plan and the studio plan and on the top, if you go for the yearly plans, you get a 50% discount. You can compare the features and select any plan that you like. So this was everything about generating 3D models from images using Meshi AI. You can now explore this tool on your own. If you want to know about another amazing AI tool that can generate 3D models from images then you can check this video right here. If you like this video then do drop a like and subscribe to my channel for more such helpful videos. Thanks for watching and I will see you in a new video.